any way you slice it, is a pretty decent Barney episode with some really strong nostalgia for me. This is the sixth episode of the third season, and this one features Stella the Storyteller, who tells one of my favorite childhood stories, the story of the little red hen. I absolutely love it. We also have children, including Kathy, Juan, Carlos, and Min. And this one is all about them trying to set up a booth or a stall that's going to be at their school's international fair. And I feel like it might have been slightly obvious with what theme they were going with as the episode progressed. And there will be spoilers as I discuss what they ultimately end up going with. And we have a lot of great songs in this, all with a, a pretty strong common theme. We have, uh, it actually starts off with the Cambodian umbrella dance, which is uh, a beautiful performance and the costumes are gorgeous. We actually have some other children doing that. They then leave and then Barney comes to life and we have uh, a couple more songs. We have one that I'm not familiar with called A La Derecha. I apologize if I'm mispronouncing that. And then the rest of the songs are, well, a few of them I know well, one of them not so much, but there is a strong common theme. And it actually starts off with our friend Barney had a band where they're playing musical instruments from different countries, which I thought was a pretty good opportunity for learning. We then had Who Took the Cookies? And then a personal favourite, Pumpernickel. I love the song Pumpernickel. I actually don't remember it from my childhood very well because... Well, I just don't. But actually, with re-watching Barney, I have grown to love it. But the reason that that part in particular was really nostalgic for me is because I have a very strong memory of a bread-tasting activity we did at school. We had loads of different types of bread. I don't know if we had pumpernickel, but we had different types of bread and different types of fillings or spreads. I know there was honey and, and some others. And it really strongly reminded me of that. So definitely very nostalgic. And then we have Make the Bread. And the song itself I don't recognize, but it's all about making bread. And again, I have another strong memory of a different occasion of making bread at school. So I had a lot of fun with that. Fun fact, I made my bread into the shape of a croissant. It wasn't a croissant. It was just average white bread. But I made it into the shape of a croissant because apparently... I thought that was a clever thing to do. I don't know. But definitely a lot of nostalgia here, not so much from the songs, but from the activities themselves. And if it encourages children watching it to try other breads, other foods that they maybe haven't had, that's a brilliant thing. And of course, there are opportunities for learning about different cultures here. And to top it all off, we have the brilliant story of the little red hen, which is absolutely a childhood favourite. Anyway, you slice it as a delightful episode very nostalgic for me in, in certain ways with some really good songs and stories and a nice opportunity for learning. It's definitely a pretty decent episode.